time has by no means healed Mary Coleman's broken heart. I, I'm lonely all the time, you know, even though it's 22 years, it just kills me to think that we lost Connor for something so instantaneous. September 2001, 15-year-old Connor Coleman and his friends, twins Kean and Gavin O'Sullivan, also 15, were passengers when a car being driven by their friend, 22-year-old Paula Donovan, crashed into another car on the outskirts of Cork. The four friends were killed. The two occupants of the other car also died. Mary Coleman is now speaking out in the hope she can help to put an end to the carnage on our roads. He and I, my husband and I, Beth, had to go to the funeral home and pick out a coffin. I never thought I'd ever see the day that I'd have to pick out, pick out a coffin for one of my children. Um, pick out a coffin, decide where we're going to bury him, buy a grave, like go to uh, inquests and all sorts of meetings after the crash and then hear the injuries. Can you imagine that you hear your, your little boy who was 15 years of age had all these horrendous injuries. They, I wouldn't want to say it here because it's just mm. here in my heart. Um, I did get his belongings back from the hospital, whereas some people said, oh God, don't do that. No, you know. But I, I had precious moments with his jumper and the smell of him, you know. I mean, something so simple. Horrible, horrible, it's horrible. But people don't think, they don't know unless they're closely associated with this kind of thing. Behind every road fatality, a grieving family. Paul Byrne, Virgin Media News, Cork.